Hey everybody, this is Scott with uh, Keeping Real Bass Fishing, still out here pond fishing. And we're bank fishing at these here ponds. I just wanted to jump back in here and let you know our progress so far today. I've, that pond I showed you earlier, I've uh, fished it all the way uh, around like I told you I was going to with the frog and caught three on the back end. And I missed three on the other side that boiled on it pretty good. They're about two pound fish piece. Um, sorry I don't got it on video. I'm out here by myself. And um, I don't have a GoPro right now uh, to be able to record while I'm fishing. I'm working on uh, mosquitoes. Working on uh, getting that uh, or getting one of those GoPros and learning how to use that so I can actually... Uh, do some filming while we are fishing or I'm fishing or whoever's with me and uh, so we can record some of that for you as well I'm an old school guy uh, all this stuff is new to me YouTube the YouTube video recording and uh, uh, the, all the stuff that goes on today with this technology is uh, I'm up to speed on it but some of the stuff is you know still new to me and um, Especially, you know, learning how to do all this video recording, editing, and all the things that need to be done to, to make this the best possible for all my viewers. Um, I talked to some guys who use the GoPros, told me about that, uh, and, and definitely need to get one, and, uh, and and also how to put together some good editing and so forth. But you know, I like to keep it real. Yeah, that's why I call my broadcast, uh, you know, this channel, Keeping It Real Bass Fishing. You know, I'm old school and uh, not afraid to learn something and do something new school as well. But, uh, hey, we're still out here. Look at this pretty lake right here. This is, you see that right there? That pond right there, this is a different pond that's right across the street from the other one. my well it's out of my car but you see the pond that's the one i just fished and i come across the street to fish this one it's it's actually a little darker than it looks on the video for some reason the video's doing a really good job with this iphone but it's almost getting to a point where i'm gonna have to take off out of here probably another 10 15 minutes but i wanted to get this last uh little bit of fishing in before it gets dark because uh, it's actually the best time, this time of year, to, to be on these type of waters with these ponds, these small reservoirs, on uh, a top water bite. You know, buzz bait, uh, frogs, spooks, pop bars. And buzz baits do real good. Uh, there are some uh, whopper ploppers. I've caught a lot of big bass on whopper ploppers. And uh, matter of fact, I caught a 10 pounder, I believe it was last year, on a get us whopper plopper <laughs> and a pond over in dog town but uh i fish ponds in fort Payne. i fish ponds up in dog town uh down in anyana over up here in the huntsville and uh lord mercy I'm, this all around i can't even remember half the places uh but anyway it, been a bunch of good fish. I like to fish them this time of year, especially. Try to catch a top water bite. And ain't nobody out here beating them up. But unfortunately, I mean, these waters right here have been fished a good little bit. It ain't just me out here. It is today, and ain't nobody. But uh, there's a bunch of people come and go. They're just not catching much out here because they don't look like a lot of folk. They just put a bobber on and a hook and a cricket, a minnow, or a worm, or something. And, um, skis, gosh, and just hope for the best. <laughs> Ain't nothing wrong with that, you know, if that's all you got to do. But if you want to catch some bass and big bass, there's a lot more to it. Need some good rod and reels, uh, a lot of, and good tackle, and strong line. We'll talk about that on another video on, uh, what kind of rod and reels, uh, you know, uh, I recommend it. 
all kinds of them. Man, these mosquitoes are getting bad. I'm gonna have to get out of here. I'm sorry for that, but uh, anyway, whew. we'll talk about that on another video. What are these mosquitoes eating me alive? Keeping it real. I'll check back in with you later. Y'all have a good evening.